Astronomers have made a groundbreaking discovery in the distant galaxy OJ-287, located 4 billion light-years away from Earth. This galaxy harbors one of the most extreme black hole systems ever observed, a binary supermassive black hole. Recent observations revealed a unique feature. The jet emitted by one of the black holes is severely bent. This could be due to the gravitational influence of the second black hole in the system. In today's video, we'll explore this discovery, its significance, and what it means for future research on gravitational waves. OJ-287 is a blazar, which is a type of active galactic nucleus with a supermassive black hole at its center. Blazars are among the most energetic objects in the universe, and their signature jets are expelled at nearly the speed of light. However, what makes OJ-287 stand out is the unique shape of its jet. Unlike the straight jets typically observed in blazars, the jet from it has a pronounced curvature, bending and precessing around its axis. This bizarre phenomenon was captured in stunning detail through high-resolution radio wavelength images. These images were made possible by the international collaboration of telescopes, including the Very Long Baseline Array in the United States and the Radio Astron Mission in space. The resulting data showed that the jet's orientation shifts over time, suggesting that its path is influenced by the gravitational pull of a second smaller black hole orbiting the main one. This binary system is pivotal to understanding how these two supermassive interact. The primary has a mass of 18.35 billion solar masses, while its companion is about 150 million solar masses. The two black holes are in an elliptical orbit, and every 12 years, the smaller passes through the accretion disk of the larger one. During this encounter, the smaller disturbs the flow of matter in the accretion disk, causing bursts of energy. This dynamic interaction leads to significant variations in the brightness of the system, which has been tracked over more than 150 years. In 2021, OJ-287 brightened a hundredfold in 12 hours as its smaller component plunged through the larger one's accretion disk, offering rare insight into binary IT dynamics. One of the most exciting aspects of it is its potential for generating gravitational waves. Gravitational waves are ripples in space-time caused by the acceleration of massive objects such as merging black thieves. In the case of OJ-287, the two black holes are slowly spiraling toward each other, emitting weak gravitational waves in the process. However, these waves are currently too weak to be detected by ground-based observatories like LIGO, as their frequency is too low for such instruments to capture. Future space-based missions, such as the Laser Interferometer Space Antenna LISA, are designed to detect these low-frequency gravitational waves. LISA, which is set to launch in the 2030s, will be capable of observing the in-spiral and eventual merger of supermassive BEEV like those in OJ-287. The waves generated by this merger will carry crucial information about the properties of these and the dynamics of their interaction. This data will allow scientists to test our understanding of general relativity in extreme conditions. In the meantime, gravitational wave researchers are using pulsar timing arrays to indirectly detect these waves. As gravitational waves pass through space, they affect the timing of the regular pulses emitted by neutron stars. By studying these subtle variations, scientists hope to detect the low-frequency gravitational waves generated by systems like it. Although these waves are faint, they provide a valuable opportunity to study these systems that are otherwise out of reach for current detectors. Detecting gravitational waves from it would reveal how black holes evolve and when they merge, produce a powerful burst offering rare insights into cosmic forces. OJ-287 offers a unique environment for testing key aspects of black hole physics. Its binary black hole system allows scientists to study the interaction between two supermassive in a way that no other known system can. 
This is particularly important for understanding how these grow, interact, and influence the galaxies around them. The gravitational waves emitted by the two black holes in OJ287 are expected to provide critical data for refining our models of mergers. By studying the signals from these waves, scientists can gain a deeper understanding of how supermassive black these evolve and the role they play in the formation of galaxies. Furthermore, the behavior of the crooked jet in it offers new insights into the physics of accretion disks, jets, and the extreme environments around these. Its role in the study of gravitational waves is particularly exciting as it provides a bridge between the electromagnetic observations of these and the gravitational wave signals that will soon be detectable. The eventual merger of these two black holes will be one of the most significant events in astrophysics, and studying this system in detail will help scientists develop new methods for detecting and analyzing gravitational waves from other mergers in the future. Looking forward, future observations of this particularly through space-based observatories like LISA, will provide valuable data on the behavior of supermassive these and the gravitational waves they produce. As these observations progress, scientists will be able to test the limits of general relativity and explore new realms of physics, unlocking further mysteries of the universe. OJ287's binary black hole system is a rare lab for studying jets, outbursts, and gravitational waves. With upcoming missions like LISA, we're closer than ever to unlocking its secrets, so let's keep watching.